Good morning everybody, welcome back to the vlog, welcome back to the channel, my name is Anthony. I don't usually vlog on my work days, um, however I got a very interesting job this morning um, to drive all the way out to the Clarence Valley's famous gorge and I thought I would show you a few of the sights, a few of the views and a few of the uh, interesting structures along the way. So, we're going to go for a bit of a drive. <laughs> Along interesting bridges, like that one, um, providing I can do it in such a way that it's safe and it's alright, it's legal because we're on private property right now. So I can do this and show you guys the journey. It's very beautiful country out here, it's about 7 o'clock in the morning. Um, very picturesque so I'm gonna show you some of the stuff that I like um, and we're gonna get home I, I guess it, it's about a half an hour drive back to the public road so let's get going Another interesting bridge. Um, so it takes about half an hour, I guess, 20 minutes to get back to the main road. Mainly because we have to do like 10 k's an hour. We're in a pretty low slung um, Camry, so I don't want to do any damage to the underside. I don't want to smash the sump or anything silly like that. So that's two of the interesting bridges down. I'm going to stop it for the moment. I'll be back with you once I get to the next one. The battery in the GoPro is a little low. I need to charge it. I don't have got my cable with me. And there's some other sites I want to show you further along. So I'm going to turn you off and uh, push these flies will piss off. Um, <laughs> I'll see you when I show you the next bridge. Alrighty, so we're coming up to that well, first bridge, but last bridge for us as we're going out of the property. I uh, just thought I'd show you the view. Pretty bloody rocky here, so I'm just gonna take it easy. Don't want to be bruising any tires or damaging anything under the car.
can't say that my job is not interesting sometimes. I get to see beautiful sights like this and drive on some really interesting roads. All right, so that was the last of the interesting bridges. I'm gonna save the battery um, for some of the nicer looking sights. So I'm gonna switch you guys up for the moment and I'll see you when I come back. Uh, a bit further along the track, uh, here comes a bit more interesting parts of the trail. I'll show you now, a bit of a nicer view. So if you are thinking about heading out to the gorge um, and you have a car that's a little bit lower than standard or a low slung car, I highly suggest you might rethink it, um, unless you know how to drive to these sort of conditions. But if you do come out here, it is very remote, there's no phone service. Um, as you can see, so I suggest you have at least a two-way radio with you, um, the property hands and the owners and all that all run on UHF channel one out here, um, most of the other people out here probably on channel one just to make it easier on folk to contact them, I mean they're all sort of really friendly out here, they all look out for each other. Um, That's why the house is over there. Uh, and they'll come and help you when you need. Um, especially if you do something dumb like drive off the road or whatever or have a flat tire and you don't know how to change it or you injure your car to a point where it needs towing. Um, they will help you out too. Hopefully. Pretty The locals around this area are pretty good. Anyway, enough yabbing. I'm going to show you some more of the view. I'm going to go again. Oh. <laughs> I love the view out here. I love the country. Um, anyway, I'm going to go again. And if I see something else, well, I know I'm going to see something else, I will show you guys. Alrighty. So, we're uh, leaving the private property. Really see that sign. And see that sign there. So we're uh, off the private property, however the road is still pretty good now, um, it's council road again I guess, so I'm not going to do too much filming, I'll probably stop and do some filming, but it's very bright, I need to put my sunglasses back on. Um, Alright, I'll see you when I find some interesting stuff to show you.
All right, so a bit further along, um, if you have a look up there, that's the road over there that it's come with. Come along. Over up there, you see some of the uh, trees and the clouds and the color that I uh, brought out here said that it was all on fire here a couple of weeks ago um, during our bushfire crisis that we've been going through. You can't really see it too well this close up. I might wait till I get a bit further away. However, you should be able to see sort of like the brown orangeness of the leaves. Um, but yeah, all that was on fire. Some of our LATs and, and small tankers were dropping fire retarded on it. Um, very, very lucky. Um, even just here where I'm about to drive past. Um, all of that was on fire only a few weeks ago. And then we got a, a, a deluge of rain, del deluge, whatever you want to say, um, of rain, and it just makes everything so much green. It's, it's amazing how fast um, it regenerates. Certainly a remarkable countryside out here. Anyway guys, I'm going to uh, stop for the minute. I'll be back with you shortly. I'm just trying to preserve the battery life of the GoPro show you as much as I possibly can out here because it really is a beautiful countryside. It's just a bit more of a view of the uh, mountain that was on fire. You can see how much of it was on fire. It certainly would have been a sight to see that place up there on fire. It really would have. would have scared the daylights out of a lot of the animals that are around here. A lot of cattle out here, a lot of uh, Australian wildlife too. I've seen a couple of kangaroos. Pretty sure I uh, saw a fox and a few other things as well. Anyway, GoPro's batteries on his last bar and there's some more things I want to show you so... Alright guys, I'm pretty much back to the main road soon. I just thought I'd call it quids here because the battery is really going really low. Thought I'd show you where I've been. Just come up there from Table Creek. Anyway, gonna see you later on. Peace.